now I was thinking about showing how I'm doing the chest area. You can see it's sort of here, you can feel the tip of the breastbone. It's starting here. And then you're supposed to have a V from like the side and then down to the breastbone. And then getting a little bit more here, here. Uh, so you should keep it a little bit shorter like the V but not too short because it should be um, good transitions so not from like completely flat to puffy or like a lot of hair so now we'll just strip a little bit and then try to show you afterwards the result And then your best help is the metal comb. You will take it like this and do like this. Uh, but it's easier throughout the body. Nobody doesn't want to do it now. But I can do it like a little bit. And then sometimes if the dog is more sore, in the skin it helps to hold a little bit back okay she's much better on like a professional table compared to just my desk It's not long since I stripped her here. It's not that that much I need to take. And then often when you start stripping, then you realize it's more than needs to be stripped. So then you are like in a circle of just stripping all the time. She's just getting a treat while I'm explaining, trying to. You can see now I need to take a little bit like here, uh, but you can maybe see that it's like a more of a V type and also I need to take a little bit more here to get the V uh, but um, the breastbone is here so just the longest parts here it's a little bit hard to do it like click so huh? You can see that that got better just by taking the stuff and then maybe I can take like some dot here but I'm taking less than I should do. The reason for that is that then you can see how much you need to take and you haven't taken too much of the or pulled too much of the hair out already.